or TRT World's Miriam Francois has more. France's financial prosecutor has opened an investigation into the alleged misuse of public funds by the wife, Penelope Fillon, of the uh, presidential candidate to the right, François Fillon. Now, the allegations are that between 1998 and 2012, she received around half a million euros uh, salary, um, and that was for a position as a parliamentary assistant to her husband. The issue is that the uh, newspaper that broke the story alleges that that is a fictitious position that she was not actually employed and uh, there have been a number of people who've come out and said that they were not aware uh, of uh, Mrs. Fion's work uh, wi uh, within the assembly at any point during that time. Now it's, it is also uh, worth stating that there have been some counters to that. Some people who have uh, responded that they did see uh, Madame Fion uh, around the assembly but it wasn't always clear what her position was. Uh, as for uh, himself, Francois Fion will be presenting documents uh, as early as uh, today uh, to try and uh, correct what he considers to be uh, mudslinging in the race to the elections uh, in May. And so he thinks that this is all part of a campaign to try and discredit his name, having really prided himself on an image of a, um, a squeaky clean um, politician who was who's come along to really try and clean up the image of corruption within French politics, not least on the French right. Um, the issue, of course, is uh, w if these allegations do prove to be true, that they could be damaging long term to his prospects. He has already uh, suffered a fall in popularity um, in the last month, having dropped, according to some polls, a full seven points um, after um, his presentation of his position, uh, particularly on uh, social welfare issues, which has seen some concern uh, among the elderly uh, and uh, women in particular. Now, at the moment, he's polling around 25 to 28 percent. But that isn't a huge lead on the second most popular pres uh, presidential candidate, and that is Marine Le Pen from the National Front, who's currently polling around 20 to 24 percent. Uh, so certainly uh, any dent to that lead uh, could be worrying for the right.